So the queen of rap, Nicki Minaj, reacts to her husband, Kenneth Petty, being sentenced. And of course, y'all know Kenneth Petty had this SEX case going on or this SEX offender case going on. And basically, he's finally been sentenced. And Nicki Minaj is actually reacting to this whole thing. He also, you know, made a plea in court as it relates to him doing, you know, these terrible things in the past. And I'm here to give you all the information as it relates to all of that. Right, guys? So before I get into the video, don't forget to like this video. Don't forget to subscribe and make sure you turn that notification bell on. That way you'll be able to get notified whenever I post a new video. And I'm going to be reading an article, right, guys? But of course, I'll have to change up some of the words or I might have to spell certain words because y'all know that YouTube is very sensitive as it relates to these type of topics and I do not want my video to get flagged you get what I'm saying guys so let's get to this story y'all can tell me what y'all think about this in the comment section and don't forget to subscribe like I said guys and turn the notification bell on all right so it says Nicki Minaj reacts after husband Kenneth Petty sentence in SEX offender case Nicki Minaj shows her husband some support following his sentencing yesterday in his ongoing SEX offender case Nicki Minaj's husband Kenneth Petty will be close to his family over the next year as he has been sentenced to a year of home detention for failing to register as a SEX offender in California. Prosecutors were pushing for the rapper's husband to go to jail for 15 months and to be put on five years probation. However, Judge Justice Michael Fitzgerald on Thursday offered the home detention and also added three years probation and a $55,000 fine. Kenneth Petty is to be confined to his wife's mansion in California according According to the judge, Kenneth Petty failing to register as a SEX offender was a less severe offense compared to other offenses. Along with the fact that prisons were overburdened and the fact that prisons are expecting a surge in COVID cases from the Omicron variant, the prison was the least favorable way to handle the case. Petty had pleaded guilty to the offense in September 2021 and threw himself at the mercy of the court. His wife did not physically support him, but she did write a letter on his behalf for the defense team speaking about her son's possible impact from his father going to jail. I have no doubt my son would be traumatized if his father would be taken out of his life. Minard said, I've known Petty, I've known Kenneth Petty for over 20 years. When I first met him, I knew he needed guidance. I've seen his genuine evolution firsthand. She vouched for Petty. Petty also expressed remorse for breaking the law and for also causing shame on his wife's brand. I take full responsibility for whatever happens today he said I'm ashamed embarrassed and disrespected my wife Bran there are no excuses I broke the law I thank you for giving me the chance to speak to apologize meanwhile a TMZ report says that the prosecutors were not happy with the sentence as they argued that home detention was not real punishment because he lives in a luxurious multi-bedroom mansion in a gated Calabas community with his wife as compared to the bare provision a jail would offer Petty's offense stemmed from the requirement by California law to register as a SEX offender due to his 1994 conviction for RAPE in New York City where he served over four years in prison. Petty moved to California to be with Minaj in 2019 and was busted by police during a traffic stop. On Thursday night, Minaj reacted on Instagram by sharing several photos, family photos and photos of Petty with their two-year-old son Papa Bear. All right, guys, so what do y'all think? Do y'all think that the judge made the right decision? Or do you think Kenneth Petty should have served some time behind bars? Do you think, you know, the prosecutors were being petty? <laughs> yeah, you know? Uh, or do you think, you know, the judge made the right decision? That's all I'm asking, guys, because obviously, I know Nicki Minaj would have been crushed if he was to serve any time at all in prison and his son would actually miss him as well but that's why you don't break the law you don't break you don't do certain things if you can't handle the sentencing but it seems like the judge was being you know very fair the judge might actually be a fan of Nicki Minaj I'm not gonna say a fan because you know I mean to me the judge was being pretty nice you get what I'm saying because he could have given him some time behind bars even if it's like six months or whatever it may be but you know, 
he think that it's not that severe which i mean at the end of the day it is a rule and you should definitely register if you did some dirty stuff in the past you get what i'm saying but let me know what y'all think about this in the comment section guys and thank you all for watching don't forget to like share and subscribe and i will see you all in the next video stay safe peace